Hi guys, this is my first YouTube video. Um, shout out to Love Pink Hello Kitty, Jerushka Couture, Queen Cats, Lady Vogue, and anybody else who's made a Louis Vuitton video because if you've made it, I have seen it. Um, so this is a video review of the new Louis Vuitton Sully bag. <clears throat> I went into the store on Friday the 13th, January, and I was looking for the Totally MM bag and my essay told me that there were only three left in the company, one of which was in my city, <clears throat> excuse me, and uh, it was already on hold. <clears throat> so I was looking at the delightful GM and also the Galliera, Galliera excuse me, GM. Um, so she showed me this new bag. She said it had just been released on that day, the 13th, and she said it was the Sully. Um, I haven't seen it online yet, and there's not a lot of internet buzz on it, so I'm not quite sure. It does come in two sizes, the PM, and I guess she said this was the MM. I don't know what the... It doesn't... Oh, it's MM. Excuse me. MM. So <clears throat> I bought it because it, it, it did kind of appeal to me. I like the hardware. Um, so here's the receipts. Uh, I don't know if you could see them. They are backwards on my computer. Neiman Marcus. The bag is $13.80. It's the Sully MM. It's M40587 for the Louis Vuitton code. Um, <clears throat> it comes in this sleeper bag, drawstring. Um, I already took it out of the box because I've already looked at it and tried it, so I didn't want to waste your time with that. Um, so here it is, the new Sully bag. Sort of a combination between delightful and a little bit artsy. Um, the width of the bag is 18 and a half. The height is 12 and a half. The strap length from here to here is about 11 and a half. The thickness is about 5 sixteenths. Your strap drop, depending on how you have it, I mean, if it's up like this, it's about four and a half. If you fill it up, it can go nine inches. Um, one thing you'll notice, the strap length is shorter than the opening of the bag because the strap length is about 11 and a half and the opening of the bag is about 16 inches. So you can't really completely open the bag this way. Um, the weight empty is a pound and 10 ounces. So it's a very light bag. It's got the D-rings. Now the thing about this bag is it doesn't have the Louis Vuitton on the rings, um, which a lot of the other bags do. It's not on either ring. Now it is on these little pulls right here in the, the brass pulls here, Louis Vuitton. And it's on both sides. The other thing that's kind of different is um, the strap usually has Louis Vuitton imprinted across this, but this new strap has Louis Vuitton Paris, so it's a little different. It does have two zipper pulls. Excuse me. Louis Vuitton. And the zipper is a little difficult to open, but I'm guessing that's because it's new. I don't know. Maybe it'll loosen up over time. Louis Vuitton, made in France. Um, on this side, there are two slip pockets. I'm sorry, the lighting seems not greatest, but here, slip pocket here, slip pocket here. On the opposite side, one large slip pocket. It's a fairly deep bag. And the date code, hold on just a second. The date code is, sorry, I'm not sure if you'll be able to see this. Um, 
it's a nice bag. It's very simple. I'm not quite sure about it yet. Um, very simple. Um, if you have it full, you can arrange it so that it has a little bit of a drop. Size-wise, it's uh, comparable to the Delightful PM. And just as a comparison, it's a little bit bigger in height than the Delightful PM, but about the same width as the Delightful, maybe a little bit bigger. I say I'm not quite sure about this bag yet. I mean, I love the bag. It's, you know, well made. I love the zippers. I'm just wondering whether or not um, this is going to work for me. So tell me what you guys think. I mean, what do you think? I'm debating on, um, I have the Delightful, but I really do like a bigger bag. This would be a good bag for every day, um, but I'm still kind of debating on the larger Delightful GM or the Galliera. So leave your comments below. Let me know what you think. If you have a Louis Vuitton video, let me know, because I'm always interested in watching those. Thank you to everyone who made the Louis Vuitton videos, because they really helped me when I went into the store the first time. I did learn that um, my Louis Vuitton stores are, are not as customer oriented apparently because both times I went in to buy bags um, I did not get the brown envelope um, they did tell me that because of Christmas they were kind of out of everything so I did just get the Louis Vuitton receipt I also did not get um, the ribbon around the box I don't know if that's normal for everything but from watching videos, I was kind of interested to see that my experience was a little different than some other people. So leave your comments below. Let me know. Thanks. Have a great day.